Boop. Boop. It was in the spring that I returned to my village, Sunflower Ridge, after a long two years of seeking fortune. Boop. When I discovered that something was wrong. My name is Rixensart, and this is my test. Boop. You'd best turn and leave this place, or else you will become property of Pyromaster. And you'd best listen to me, Wolf Dude, as my father is Chancellor of this village, and I am thereby Prince Chancellor, and I command you to leave. Ha! That is truly rich, boy. Your father and all other residents of this village have now become slaves to my master, the one and only Pyromaster who burns all enemies to dust. No. Father. Boop. Oh, Father. How I worry for you. And Sunflower Ridge. Oh, how you have fallen in my absence. Young man, what causes you to verily weep? Good frog. I have just returned from business abroad to discover my village captured by a fiery menace. Ah, yes, you must be speaking of Pyromaster. He is a fiery menace indeed. Well, sir, if I were in your position, I would want to take back control of the village. Of course, you would need some help. Are you offering your services? Yes. Boop. What are you blokes doing on this fine day? I wish I could agree, sir, that it is a fine day. My village, Sunflower Ridge, of which I am the Prince Chancellor, has been enslaved and ravaged by Pyromaster. We are on our way there to attempt a rescue of my people. My friend, are you familiar with Pyromaster? Crikey, I am! That little bugger was responsible for burning down my village and murdering my wife and financial advisor. Would you care to join our quest to take back Sunflower Ridge from this dastardly foe? Most certainly. Hey, what's up, fellas? I'm coming too. Boop. With the image of his townspeople trapped in his mind, young Rixen Sart set out some allies to find. A frog from a bog taught him courage and strength. An Australian tiki with hair of great length. A last minute unicorn joined for the fray. For Sunflower Ridge now our friends make their way. I hail from the land called the U.S.O. <laughs> Boop. Well, what have we here? Is this the Prince Chancellor returning with all his weakling friends? I have a good mind to eat all of you. Actually, fiendish wolf, I have brought with me the Lily of Change, which I will now use to render you a foul. <laughs> Boop. Oh, you don't see that every day. Hey, anybody feel like roasted chicken? I'm just joking. Boop. Vile skeletons, I am Prince Chancellor of this village, and I command you to release these people. We answer to no one but Pyromaster. Perhaps you should join these pathetic souls in their imprisonment. Actually, I have a bone to pick with you boys, and I've brought with me the Fife of Slumber, which I will now use to ensure you all rest in peace. Ooh, hey, how do you like them apples? Boop. There finally is our enemy. But he rides atop a beast of burden, and he must be dismounted if we are to challenge him. Beast of burden? Forget about it. I brought with me my horn of sharpness. Oh, right in the gut. That's a ticket. Boop. So, you've come to save your wretched village. We'll see if you're any match for my flames. How'd you like a little root beer, Pyromaster? No! I'm fizzling! Now that's some fizzle for your shizzle. <laughs> Boop! Prince Chancellor, thank you so much for saving our village. You're quite welcome, Charles. Now you may go back to running your grocery store in peace. And you, Miranda, weaver of the town quilt, you may go back to your masterpiece. 
I expect it shall be marvelous. Oh, I guess we'll just have to wait and see, Prince Chancellor. Thank you. Boop. Rix and Sart, I am proud of you. You looked into the eye of evil today and saved this village which means so much to all of us. Father, I could not have won back the freedom of Sunflower Ridge without the help of my new friends. I found them all walking around in the woods and stuff. Very well, my son. Your friends may now consider themselves citizens of Sunflower Ridge. Kilt Master Pyro, America is the best USA go. <laughs>